Here are ten free things to do in New York. Hi, my name is Pooja from Color Me in Style. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Let's do this, shall we? First up is Times Square. Come here at night to experience the vibe and the lights. Take care of your wallet though, as it's easy for pickpockets to do their jobs. Next up is Central Park. It is completely free and there's a lot to see here. If you're looking for a Central Park guide, then check out my video that's linked here. At number three comes the Brooklyn Bridge Walk. This is me walking from Brooklyn to Manhattan on the bridge. But you can start the walk from either side. For a detailed video on the Brooklyn Bridge Walk, click here. At number four, we have the Dumbo Manhattan Bridge viewing spot. This is one of those places which you see a lot on Instagram. Next up is the Emily Warren Roebling Plaza. This is just by James Carcel and gives you a great view of the Brooklyn Bridge and also the Manhattan Bridge in one go. It's a great area for a lovely walk along the Hudson River and also, uh, you know, there's food options and while you're in the neighborhood of Dumbo in Brooklyn, this is a superb option to come and see and it's all for free. Next up is the Staten Island Ferry. Yes, this is a completely free ferry that you can take to Staten Island and this is the view that you will get of the Statue of Liberty. If you want a comparison of the New York ferries then click here. Next up is Bryant Park. This is where you find that amazing view of the Empire State Building all for free. This is also a great spot to grab some lunch on the go. Now it's time for the Grand Central Station. It's completely free to enter this um, concourse that you see here which is quite famous um, and has been shot in a lot of movies and series and Bollywood movies as well. This is definitely a good free spot to see in New York. Hi guys, welcome to the Oculus Center. This is another free thing you can do on your New York itinerary. Just have a look. Last but not the least is the Vessel Building in Hudson Yards, which is right behind me. You can go and stand inside this beehive structure, which is currently free. Um, but even if you stand outside and take a picture with this spectacular piece of building, it's worth it. I know I said 10 things, but here's a bonus. This is Highline Park, which is very close to the Vessel Building and it's um, completely free, so it's worth coming here. This is basically old train tracks that have now been converted into um, a park, um, which is a great place for people to meet, sit down and just, you know, eat and, you know, mix and mingle, I guess. Um, and it makes for a great green space. So I hope you enjoyed this video and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I will see you soon with some more content. See ya!